Hello everyone and welcome to my sister wife's bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Garrison Brown, the son of Cody and Janelle Brown, sadly took his own life at the age of 25 in Flagstaff, Arizona, over a month ago. The Sister Wives stars met for a funeral ceremony hosted by the Nevada National Guard in Las Vegas on March 9, where Cody, accompanied by his wife Robin, seemed aloof and avoided engaging with his former wives Janelle, Christine, and Mary, according to reports. Sources close to the family have indicated that Cody is profoundly battling with his mental health in the aftermath of Garrison's death. Described as being in a, a very dark place, Cody is apparently battling significant depression and has retreated from others. His relationship with Robin is believed to be tight, with Cody internalizing his feelings and focusing inward, producing conflict between them. Despite these issues, insiders believe that divorce is not inevitable for Cody and Robin, but his conduct is placing a strain on their marriage. Cody's inclination to withdraw and shift blame to Robin during times of crisis is compounding their troubles. However, experts say that until Cody makes big adjustments and stops pushing Robin away, a divorce is improbable. Garrison's difficulties with depression and alcohol addiction were known, and his last letters hinted to his inner agony. The family had suffered criticism throughout the epidemic owing to Cody's stringent standards, which created to stress among the family. Even though Cody and Garrison remained apart until Garrison's departure, insiders suggest that it will take substantial time for Cody's estranged children to contemplate reconciling with him, particularly in light of their recent tragedy. Currently, Cody is claimed to be preoccupied by sadness and is not pondering reconciliation attempts, further hurting his connection with his estranged children. Repairing the damage in their relationships will need tremendous work and time on Cody's behalf as his family navigates the aftermath of Garrison's sad death. Cody's friendship with Garrison worsened throughout the COVID-19 phase. Their fragile friendship endured till the latter ended up taking his own life. Hence Sister Wives actor Cody is now just left with the memories of his kid and is presently grieving his tragic demise. Amid all this, observers noticed Cody becoming standoffish at Garrison's memorial. He acted in a peculiar way amid his distant connection with Janelle and other kids. What did he do? How did Cody cope with the Browns at Garrison's memorial? Sister Wives star Garrison Brown is no longer in this world, and Browns aren't able to get over his tragedy. They recently lay him to rest, which was followed by a tribute planned by the Nevada National Guard. Almost every member of the Brown family along with Cody and Robin attended the event and recognized Garrison. Cody and Robin sat in the front row, but the former wasn't highlighted, sitting with Janelle. His distant connection with others was clear from the images, which quickly began to appear on the internet. A source even alleged, Cody was standoffish. He was more reluctant in mingling. It even showed that Robin had pushed Cody to sit with Janelle. The source added how the dynamics weren't really healthy for Robin since many family members still had hatred against her. Hence, the reunion ended up getting unpleasant. Yet the Browns opted to come together and they supported one other throughout this trying moment. This reunion didn't contain any form of arguing or hatred. The Sun also reported that Cody manned up and was vulnerable with none other than Christine's husband, David Woolley. That is why the source remarked that it was an unusual familial dynamic. Apparently, Garrison's memorial featured some furious individuals who were joined by cheerful people and many family members who were indifferent. Almost every member of the Brown family member came under the same roof due of Garrison. This happened after they had experienced a lengthy list of troubles in the past. However, the insider verified that there wasn't any form of altercation between the family. It stated it was just like, let's concentrate on Garrison type of stuff. The source stated it really wasn't about any ill-will feelings towards each other. Moreover, their major objective was to respect Garrison at whatever cost. Many of them even donned flower pattern attire to pay honor to the departed soul's preference of Hawaiian apparel. 
the insider claimed that this endeavor was basically an emotional affair between the kids. Even after all this it looks that everything wasn't as previously. As per the source there's more work that the Browns need to do to heal relations with each other. It pointed out how Cody has to do a lot to mend his relationship with his kids. However, he isn't able to focus about anything else since he is still digesting Garrison's demise and is grieving the loss. Sister Wives actress Janelle Brown is back on social media after a lengthy hiatus after the terrible loss of her son, Garrison. The Brown family has been grieving their loss. However, the 54-year-old continues to be optimistic in life. Recently, the former second wife of Cody recounted her unique moment with Logan. Some Redditors just found that Janelle is in the process of starting a new company. According to the poster, they discovered out that the Sister Wives actress mentioned a new project named Tata Farms, which would be a flower farming company. Janelle has yet to disclose her claimed new business. But many are delighted that the mother of six is prospering in life despite all the heartbreaks followed Garrison's loss. She has also been spending a lot of time with her kids. During Easter, the reality TV celebrity traveled to a beach with Maddie and her grandkids. Janelle recently went to Instagram to post a film with Logan as they watch the complete eclipse at the farm of Michelle Petty's father. According to the Sister Wives actress, she has previously believed that the entire eclipse will pass on the territory of her in-laws. She also noted that it was a fantastic day and she couldn't believe how meaningful it was to observe the event. The next total eclipse is going to be in Spain 2026 and we are wondering if we are crazy to decide to chase after it, she added. Janelle Brown has previously uploaded images from the same occasion. But many are delighted that she was able to release the video of what truly transpired. Some readers are also delighted that Janelle is back to displaying herself in public again with a huge grin on her face. It's nice to see your grin. And I say pursue it. Garrison was there with you capturing his gorgeous shots. Glad there was a time in a day with laughing. Chase the sun. You deserve it. Chase it mom. I'm simply pleased to see you smiling and if there's anything this world has taught us is to pursue your ambitions. Thanks for sharing. We had too much cloud covering to see anything. This wasn't the first time Janelle Brown uploaded good stuff on social media despite the sorrow of the Brown family. Recently, the Sister Wives actress revealed her funny interaction with Christine and Maddie. She was merely meant to contact her daughter to take her grandkids for ice cream. But she forwarded the message to their group chat instead where Christine is a member. Moments after, Christine answered and stated that she would love to eat ice cream with them. TLC has yet to announce whether they're going to bring the Brown family back to the small screen. But it was rumored that the family had already recorded for season 19 before the terrible loss of Garrison Brown. Thanks for watching if you like this video so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.